What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. You're here with me, Tutley Dockers, and today I am playing some Firebox. Um, as you can see, we bring the whole squad for this. Uh, no Mew Mew in my list. Um, just didn't feel like it. Just felt like going with a strong fire team. So we have Brexard, Charizard and Brexham. Uh, brilliant Flare, 3 Fire Energy, single colourless, 180 damage, but get 3 cards that we want from our deck. Any 3, put them into a hand. Crimson Pillar GX, brilliant GX stack. <sighs> single Fire Energy, attach 5 basic energy cards uh, from your discard pile to your Pokemon any way you like. Brilliant setup move. But if we have 2 Fire Energy on this thing, uh, it also burns and confuses your opponent which forces them to switch or go through the coin flip so it's a it's a nice card to have uh, also have the heatran gx which has burning road as its ability once during your turn when this pokemon moves from your bench to become your active pokemon you may move as uh, move any number of fire energy from your pokemon to uh, which is really good, it means you don't actually have to attach this thing, it can tack out of nowhere. Uh, it has Steaming Stomp, which is two fire energies and a colorless for 130, or Hot Burn GX. Now this is really good, late game, let's get the winner. This attack does 50 damage times the amount of fire energy attached to it. So if we've got a loaded up ball, we drop this, switch into it, and we have, so six energies is 300. Seven energies is knocking out everything in the game. So, you know, we're looking at some good numbers there. Um, we have the Nine Tails V, love this card, love this artwork. Nine Tails Shapeshifter, fire, double colorless, choose one of your opponent's active Pokemon attacks and use it as this attack, or flamethrower for a fire and three colorless, 180 damage, discard an energy from this Pokemon. Quite a nice utility Pokemon to have. Uh, we have the main beast, which is Reshizard, Reshiram and Charizard, uh, for a fire and a colorless outrage. 30 plus, 10 for every uh, damage counter on this. So if you've got 50, it will do 80. Uh, Flare Strike, which is the move that just made this. This and Picron were like the top tier tag teams. Uh, so, Flare Strike. Uh, this Pokemon can't use Flare Strike next turn. Three Fire Energy and a Colorless doing 230 damage. That's big numbers. Uh, we also have Double Blaze GX, which is for three Fire Energy, do 200 damage. But if we have an extra three, uh, this Pokemon will then do 300 damage and it ignores all effects of your opponent's Pokemon. So, that knocks out a Keldeo GX, which we don't see a whole lot of anymore. Uh, Obstagoon, which we don't see a whole lot of anymore. So, you know, with VMAX is coming out, we're in a position to be playing basics again, you know, because Obstagoon can't be played anymore because it will just get annihilated by the VMAX decks. Uh, then we have the one of Victini Prism Star, double colorless infinity, 20 times the amount of basic energy in your discard pile. This thing can rack up some stupid numbers. Again, a lovely late game attacker. But you shuffle all those fire energies back into the deck. So it also works as restock. Uh, any more attackers? Victini V, spreading flames for a colorless. Uh, attach up to three fire energy from your discard to your Pokemon in any way you like. Really good energy acceleration. Uh, also for two fires, energy burst, 30 times the amount of energy attached to both active Pokemon. Brilliant attack, it's in play in Mega Mewtwo EX, it, God of War had exactly the same attack. Uh, Tapu Lele uh, had similar, except it was 20 times per each. You know, every so often we get a Pokemon like this that is, if you go against a deck that they have to load up a load of energy, you have one of these sorts of cards. So other than that, we have the Dene for support, a full uh, three of Jirachi in here for the Stellar Wishes, just to get set up. Uh, also, I'm playing two Gustin effects. I'm playing the Custom Catchers, go get the Pokemon Vs, uh, V Maxes, anything, and also Boss's Orders, so we can actually Gust and use a support in one turn, which is sometimes quite nice. Uh, 
two of fire crystal because we're playing two pokemon that restock anyway uh for quick ball nice and quick as it states uh two reset stamps this has come in clutch for me so many times if you just need a couple uh, that one extra turn just in order to set up reset stamp them down to two or down to one preferably amazing four switches it's paramount uh two tool scrappers again pretty much lives in every deck i play uh, we are playing three of the giant hearth discard a card go get two fire energy and heat factory discard a fire energy draw three cards so again we've got some burn through the deck draw supporters in this is three cynthia two marnie and four welder welder being attached to fire energy and draw three cards so again this was broken uh tool cards in the deck actually have some this time so we have the burning scarf because we are looking at reshazard you know it had its day 230 when it had choice band it was doing 260 then it had vitality band now we can just if they hit into us they're going to take 20 damage it also works well um if we can just outrage into them and let the burning take the effect it then stops things like your spell tags actually take an effect so and all so but yeah so you know anything that has an effect based on knockout fire and attack this stops that happening uh then we've got two escape boards for the jirachis usually we're only going to have maximum of two in play and 12 fire energies which is a nice round number but yeah so that's the deck uh basically it's a fire party firebox whatever you want to call it we're bringing the big boys we're bringing the consistency and i will see you for the first match okay guys here we go against one star uh, uh some psychic dark build um i don't know that's a good thing at the minute it's like just loads of different decks coming up you, you, all right you've got your top tier meta but rogue decks do have a place in the meta as well if you want to go first, that would be much appreciated. I want to go second in the Werewolf deck. Plus, we've got no evolutions that need doing, so we're, we're okay there. <coughs> uh, this is quite a nice opening hand. If we can get into a Welder and also get into a Switch or an Escape Board, either or, quite good. But guys, uh, if you're new to the channel, don't forget, give us a subscribe if you like what you're seeing. Uh, also, if you like what you see, give us a thumbs up and uh, comment down below what you think of the deck. Anything you change, you know, obviously Rebel Clash has so many good ideas in it. Uh, and make sure you hit that notification bell so you know when I'm uploading. Come on, ADP, right. We have to move quick. Well, the deck, yes. <laughs> this is when it's just not going to play ball for me. Three hundred and ten. Okay. Okay. So we're gonna do this. Um. Gonna bring this into play. I'm going to throw away the fire energy. Go get a couple more. Uh, we're gonna use. What do we want to throw away here? I'm going to throw away one of those. Um, I'm thinking maybe go Brilliant Flare this turn. Is it Brilliant Flare? Crimson Flame. That's the one. And still a wish. There's our Welder. So we can weld out onto this. We're going to get that burn and confusion on the go. Put this into play. Switch into this. How many did I get rid of? One. Okay, so we're going to crimson pillar onto ourselves. And there we go. The three GX attacks that are in this deck 
because they all have a very very they're all very very useful okay it's a bit more difficult with charizard uh, you need two turns to like run it up whereas as you saw this can be done in a turn and heatran is whenever you can get it onto the field you're looking good so i'm going to throw away the giant earth go get a couple of energies we will attach one of those energies so we can just keep digging that heat factory gonna be doing us some good work and brilliant flare yes we will we shall go and get um, definitely need a welder definitely need a fire energy I think an escape ball, just a bit of protection. So we've got a free retreater in Jirachi. This may be a quick match. Okay, right, research. Are they going to dig in something here? They've got the retreat now, but that means they're resetting their entire hand. Well, resetting this entire big beastie here. don't think they can go for the altar creation I think if they get this out position uh, they've got to go in for uh, oh so many ultimate rate that's the one uh, just to get this set up got to if not that may be scoop C and a switch okay Um, okay, so what I'm going to do this time is get rid of the heat factory. It, it did its job. It let us dig in. I mean, look at the hand that we have now. Uh, definitely getting rid of that. Um, what can I do to get... Um, what have I got? I need a one. That's fine. I can't welder this turn. But I can set up kind of welder in effect, really. Um, so the game plan is because have they used the support? No, they haven't. Haven't they? Yes, they did. They no? I can't even remember now. <clears throat> okay, so. Leave the brakes art set up front. Attach one energy, attach the escape board. Uh, boss's orders up this. This is the dangerous thing. I've got to get the fire energies in hand before we see a. <coughs> um, Chaotic Swell, that's the one. So this can hit max for 150. We're going to ignore this completely. Now this is ready to get picked off whenever. Um, we still have one more boss's orders. We still have all of our custom catchers. So I attach, I attach. I use that to throw away this Jirachi. We don't need it anymore. We're going to use this to throw away the Marnie. We're going to draw everything out of the deck. Uh, and then we're going to boss his orders, bring this up. Uh, brilliant flare. Uh, yes, I think I need to go and get another part of the puzzle piece. Um... And draw it out because oh, he'll come in and knock this out but then I'm gonna go back and knock him out so we're looking pretty so-so here pretty cushy I 
don't think they were expecting the boss's orders. If I'm... Um, and this, I can... If they knock this out, I can still welder, attach, and use my tool scrapper. So I only have to outrage into this, so I'll still have that 230 attack left. But, what do I have? I only have the one, so everything is here and here. Okay. I think one star is struggling. Oh, a reset stamp out of nowhere. I've got my Jirachi to go find some stuff. You know, we're looking good. We are looking really, really good here. Um, oh dear. Is there a certain big doggy prize or are you looking for the energy switches now? What are you going to go get with that? ADP and water pads. Not something you tend to see together. And play switches. Mala and Lana would have been helpful before. Okay. So, going to attach there. I want to save this. So, we're going to brilliant player. We'll get everything that we want really so yes we want our other piece of this uh, we want a switch and we want this there we go one oh there's our other tool scrapper but see custom captures They don't money me or stamp me, we've got game. See, I've got everything just in case this got knocked out. Which was the plan. Give me kind of a backup plan. Please don't Marnie me. Be pleasant, one star. Be pleasant. And there was a skip. But as you can see, I had the game on board. Just pray that he didn't hit the Marnie, hit the stamp. Don't know how many stamps he would have played in that deck. But yeah, so that's my Firebox Fire Party deck. I'm going to go with Fire Party, because Firebox tends to have Mewtwo's in it and other sorts of stuff. I just quite like this. We brought all the team together and we just got to throw them at people and hope that we hit for the things that we need to. So, I will see you for game number two. Okay, guys, sour cream for game number two. We'll say heads. Give us the choice. This is why I'm a dog person, or a snake person. Okay, again, not too bad an opening in hand. We're getting to go second. So, you know, hit into the world off. We're looking good. Okay, Mew, that allows us with Welder to knock it out. I mean, 
the way to think about it is Victini V gives us the opportunity to do 90 damage turn one if we world her onto it. And <clears throat> okay, so water. Oh, that's that's not good. And a skateboard. Although water can be ADP. I didn't even celebrate the win against ADP. Going on. Okay, no, it's water. Okay. Um, Stella Wish. There's the welder. We're going to weld her straight onto this. Get things moving. Um, we're going to start throwing some stuff away as well. Never hurts. Uh, what do we have in deck here? Um, I think to go get this may help as well. Uh, going to attach there. We'll switch. And energy burst for knockout. Now, hopefully, they didn't get too much to set themselves up. What did I throw away? Two energies. Well, there's my Jirachi again. I'm quite happy with that. Thank you, good sir. Oh. Okay, so we're looking at a spread deck. Um, going to throw away this. Okay, a couple of energy. Attach it there. Instead of wish. with Marnie. I've got two in the discard pile. Um, we'll switch into this Marnie and hope to get a quick ball and a fire energy. Oi, oi, oi. We'll get that confusion on the go. Uh, get that fire energy to play. And then we can also start playing the game of loading our hand as we want it. That's why this time everyone went this first got released. I remember hearing people like <clears throat> it's not a great card. Uh, why would you play this with, with Reshazard running in the format? The ability to go get any three cards you want is broken ability. Okay. Gonna take ten damage there. Okay. So what do you have? Two hundred. Um Let's throw this way. Go get my... Oh, I can't go get my Dene. Okay. Um, don't really want to put another GX up. This makes good sense to me. Brilliant flare into it. Yes. Um, get a couple of fire from the welder. And we'll go get the giant hearth. What do you do? You need energy on to be able to do it, that's fine. Oh, 
pass now. No, carry on setting up this, which does 120. This attack also does 10 damage to each. Setting up for this spiky storm GX. This attack does 100 to all of your opponent's Pokemon that have any damage on them. We're gonna throw that away. We're gonna start throwing some energies away. Because why not? I think this is going to be quite important. We're then going to weld up onto this. Okay, so that gives me my escape board. And two engine discard. Okay, that's 180, yes. Uh, definitely want the other piece of this. Do they have any tools in play? No, they don't. Uh, we'll go get this and go get this. So they're looking to do 240, which knocks this out. But then again, 180. So we're going to go in with the Jirachi here. Um, I guess throw some of this away. How many are in there? Six, okay. Still a wish. Into another world up. Over to you in the hopes of finding the reset stamp. Okay, so we're going to put that there, reset stamp them back down to three. <clears throat> Retreat into this, and we're infinity. I did my math really, really wrong then. But it's a single price they're taking. I mean, I reset stamp them down to three, which is always a nice thing to do. Um, they're on. They're going to do it, give me the same treatment. They come out of it with a research. So. I'm going to go down to one price, they're going to go down to one price, unless they can get this loaded up now. If they get this thing ready to go, that could be game. One, two prizes there, he only needs to take one prize afterwards. You have to retreat this. Come on, you must have got the uh, energy. There's one. No. Okay. Um, going to attach that there. That I wish. There's what I wanted. 
and we're gonna pull you up we'll retreat into you and throw the tool scrapper away Shifter. Oh dear, I forgot about that one. Um, so then need to take two prizes more. Um, how many welders have I used? One, two, three. So I've got one welder left. This one doing seventy. Okay, last game. <clears throat> Fair play to Sour Cream there. Fight I played that very wrong. Frostmoth should have been target. My fault. Misplay big time. Um, but yeah, so I've got a 1 and a 1, so we're going to go into game number 3. I'll see you for the next match. Okay, guys, here we go against Ardilla, 009. We're seeing some Psychic, some Dark. I want to put heavy pressure on really, really early. Choose to go first, please. Please. Go on, Ardilla. No. Yes, yes, that's what I wanted. Okay. We're starting with a rush's art. <laughs> the times that that's been a thing. Oh, okay, that helps me a lot. Thank you, good sir. What have we got here? Cosmic burn. Da da da. -da. Is this a Mew box? There's the NK. Acrobike. There goes another energy. Mysterious treasure. Not an energy. Another NK. They're not setting it. Unless this is... No, because I didn't see... Okay, right. So, get rid of the reset stamp. Go get an energy. Uh, I'm going to get rid of the switch to. Okay, my brake zard is gone. We'll go get the nine. Tailed shapeshifter, and then we're going to try and hit this for 200 turn one. Okay, so we're going to put this into play and the detonate. Come on! Really? Oh, really? It can't be tall. Okay, I'm just put 30 poke damage on this. Dear, 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 dear. Six prizes. All of them are energy. Again, check your prizes. <clears throat> what are you going for? The Dene for an easy pick up. Okay. I want to see that balloon. I want to see that balloon. Okay. Um, I think 
think I throw away a tool scrapper. Just stop pulling energy out. Um, I don't really want this hitting me. Oh, but it doesn't matter because it can invasion. Oh, I've just stuck two fingers up my nose right there. Oh, dear, 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 dear. Because it doesn't matter now. Totally Dockers, king of the misplays, especially when he loved that card when it first came out. You bring it up, okay. I mean, I can attach, retreat it into this card, that's fine. You can invasion hit me for 120. Problem I've got right now is I need. Ah, oh, okay. Uh, we're going to get rid of Quick Ball. Go get an energy. I'm going to switch into this. And. We'll double blaze. <coughs> One and okay, so there's break guard. There's an energy. So I can hit 230 next time. They're uh, no, because they can't use a GX attack, can they? If you're using an attack that isn't a GX attack. nice to get rid of it off the field if I'm honest I don't like a copycat Mimikyu just hovering around being able to punch me back whenever I found whenever they fancy it um, I'm gonna go into this uh, I don't want to put another three prizer into play don't think Flare Strike. Okay, so there's me a skateboard. They're going to do exactly the same thing to me now. Which means I can then outrage them back. Oh, getting clever. So, what do I need? Uh, welder. Maybe I shouldn't have ditched the, uh... so there's the Mew Mew. Okay, so that means that, uh, I can't go in with Ninetales V against that. Maybe Victini V. Maybe should have listened to everybody else who plays this and play a Mew Mew in it. I don't know. Who knows? Well, a lot of other people, not me. Okay, so they're going to copy D230. So I think I've got to just basically take this to the face really right let's let's get rid of these we don't want these they cause problems okay uh, gonna get rid of one of them let's go get another one of them uh, 180 good uh, might be we'll say it is for now Okay, so I can hit 260, not quite enough, but it does get me closer to winning, 
So we're going to outrage, hit for 260. And possible. Well, if they, I'm guessing they're going to knock this out. That's going to be a thing. So now they've got the retreat, which is pretty much for free. Uh, they can only outrage me for 30 now. Which is another thing. But yeah, because Mimikyu only copies the attack, outrage is based on the attack on you. It has none, so it will be a 30 hit. Okay. <laughs> Chris, you. No. Oh, okay. Um, right, we're going to throw that away. Let's go get one of them. We're going to use this. To throw that away. Okay. Um, we'll use this, put it on there. There we go. We go get the Mewtwo. We say, well played. And we outrage again. Let's hit for the full 260, full beans. And there we go. Go. So that's our fire party box. Lots of explosions, lots of big hits. And I quite like the deck. I'm not the biggest fan of World of Decks. I just, this whole thing of an over busted support card that's very specific. Like it doesn't, you know, that's why it made fire decks so busted. But, you know, it's fun every now and again to hit into it, especially as we have other decks now that have that sort of like not to that level but there is energy acceleration in there and there is draw support so but no i quite enjoyed the deck i uh, hope you guys did too that's 2-1 beat adp and we beat mew box kind of a mew box a psychic type mew box um but yeah so if you like what you see and you haven't done it already hit that subscribe button give us a thumbs up if you like the video pop it in the comment section anything that you want to see on the channel any changes you'd make to the deck and make sure you ding that notification bell so you know when i'm uploading uh just leaves me to say stay home stay safe stay well um and take a minute every day for yourself and think about the good things in life um also live on thursday I'll see you next time. Bye.